Hello everybody and welcome to this video where today we are going to learn a little bit about how I do things and how I don't do things because the don't is more important than the do at least in this situation here. Here's the deal. Um, there have been a couple people over I guess the last year and a half who have um, come into the Poetic Anarchy course and completely have not understood what the Poetic Anarchy thing is. Like, here is a for instance. First off, if you are just writing poems and then sending them to me and wanting me to, like, critique your poems, you've come to the wrong place. That is not what this is, okay? And if your next question to that is, well, then why the hell are people paying you? Like, what do they pay you for? Okay, like, what, what is the, the point? The point is going through the lessons and growing and becoming more confident as a creator, as an artist, as a poet. That's the idea here, okay? I have a lot of feelings about how critique has gone over the years, and especially academic critique. I do not like the idea of going to university, and if you are someone who went to a university, or you have an MFA, or you have a graduate degree in whatever, then this might be difficult to hear, but this is something that I've talked about numerous times. When you go to a university and you have a professor teaching you what poetry is, what you are learning is what this poetry professor likes. When you um, turn in assignments and you turn in poems that you've written and the professor marks it up and gives it back to you, and your heart is broken because you just spilled your guts out on the page and this fucking dude or chick is like, no, this isn't good enough. I don't like this. What ends up happening in situations like this is that the students start writing poems that they know the professor will like. They start reading the professor's poetry and go, oh, okay, oh, okay. So if I basically do exactly what they're doing, they will like my stuff, okay? That is the exact opposite of what I want to do when I am going over stuff with you in the Poetic Anarchy course when you join the Anarchy crew, okay? Because would it be easy for me to take all of your poetry out there who are in the Anarchy crew and then me dissect it and twist it and turn it to where it resembles something that I would write. Of course I could do something like that. Do I wanna do that? Fuck no, absolutely not. Why would I wanna do that? Like I'm wanting to find amazing stuff that I don't know. So why the hell would I like be looking and going, oh, you know what? Like this poem is really different and unique, but I would rather it sound like I wrote it. So here's what I would do, okay? And some of you might be going, but that's not really how critique works and da 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 da, da. Now, if you're talking form and you're talking, I, I hate even talking about this anymore. I'm so bored of it all. This whole like, like meter, rhyme, um, all of the fucking shit. I don't fucking care, I don't care, okay? Yes, there are ways to objectively judge all of that stuff. But honestly, at the end of the day, especially when it comes to what rhymes you're using and stuff like that, a lot of it still falls on a subjective basis. So who fucking cares? I don't care, okay? So when you're writing, all I want to see from you is I want you to be honest I want you to find out what makes you unique and I want you to find your voice. And then once you do, I want to push you and help give you that confidence to show you that that's enough. 
That's the difference here. That's what I do. Okay. Now, the other reason why, especially right off the bat, that I don't like come at you with, oh, let me see your poems today and I'm going to critique them, especially when you're new to this, is that I'm still trying to understand the body of your work. I'm still trying to understand what makes you unique and what your voice is. So if you do things that are different and kind of out of the box, but that's like kind of jarring or weird or anything like that. At first glance, I'm going to say, oh, this is weird. This is jarring, you know, but that doesn't, that's not helpful because if you are finding the thing that makes you click, the thing that makes you unique, the thing that makes you different from every other poet out there, why the fuck would I tell you not to do that thing? The thing that makes us different is the thing that sets us apart. So, of course, I would want you to even lay into that more. And then as you start building a body of work, people who come to you and read your stuff will understand your voice and be able to, like, just find any poem and read it and go, oh, that's so-and-so. Yeah, I know that. That's so-and-so. That's definitely them. You know what I'm saying? So... All through the poetic, there's more than a hundred videos of lessons and like assignments and stuff like that. So if you come into Poetic Anarchy and you join the Anarchy crew and you haven't been doing any of the lessons, then you're doing this wrong. And if this is something that isn't for you, then please go and be well. And I appreciate you a hundred percent, you know, like you are definitely looking for something else. I'm not trying to mold you into anything. I'm trying to let you mold yourself into something and be okay with that and be happy with that and be proud of that, okay? So I know that academia's whole thing is we're gonna sculpt and mold people into our image. And I'm not interested in that. So if that's something you wanna do, you need to find a place where someone is so fucking full of themselves that they can't wait to tell you how wrong you are, because that's not what this is, okay? So, whatever. Um, keep buying my books. Join the Anarchy crew down below. Um, again, over 100 videos of lessons and assignments and workshops and stuff like that. Um, yeah, so just type hard, everybody, and I will talk to you all later. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Crew and my followers on Patreon. I appreciate the hell out of you guys. And thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew or the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.